Hi friends, welcome back to Dian's Paradise and I hope all are doing good. Today I'll show you how to make pineapple upside down cake. Also I'll show how to cut and preserve pineapple slices that can be used for cakes, desserts or salad. Take a medium sized pineapple, peel and slice them. Now we have to remove the center portion of the slices. Here I'm using one of my piping nozzle to do this. You can use any sharp round object for this. To make the syrup, I'm taking 4 cups of water. To this add 1 cup of sugar. Once the sugar dissolves completely, drop the pineapple slices into the syrup and let this boil for 20-25 minutes on medium high flame or until the slices become soft. After 20-25 minutes, turn off the flame and let the pineapples and the syrup cool down completely. If you are using tin pineapples then you can skip this entire step and follow the procedure from here. First let's get our cake tin ready. Here I am using a 7 inch cake tin. Apply generous amount of butter all over the tin. Now spread some brown sugar about 4 to 5 tablespoons at the bottom. If you don't have brown sugar then you can use sugar caramel or even you can skip this step. Now place the pineapple slices in such pattern you want your cake to look from top because right now the downside of the cake will become your upside of the cake later. That is the reason this cake is called upside down cake. Now place some cherries in between the pineapple slices. This looks ready. Now into another bowl take 3 4 cup of soft butter. You can use salted or unsalted. Blend this for 30-35 seconds and then add 3 4 cups of powdered sugar to it. And blend until they look light, creamy and fluffy. Don't forget to clean the sides of the bowl in between. Now add 3 large size eggs to this. Don't add all the 3 eggs in one go. Add them one by one and blend. Here goes the third egg. It looks creamy and fluffy and now it's time to add the dry ingredients which is 3 4th cup of maida, half teaspoon of baking powder and a quarter teaspoon of salt. Mix them all together then see when add to our wet ingredients. Slowly fold the flour into the wet ingredients. And finally I am adding quarter teaspoon of pineapple essence. If you don't have pineapple essence you can use pineapple juice or even vanilla essence for this. Blend this all together for 30 seconds to 1 minute and then our batter is ready. Drop the batter into the cake tin slowly and spread them evenly. Bake this in a preheated oven at 180 degrees celsius for 20 minutes. This is how our cake looks after 20 minutes. It's cooked perfectly. You can check it using a skewer. Let it sit on a wire rack for 10 minutes. Then while it's still warm, run a knife through the sides and then flip it over the plate or the dish you want to serve. A gorgeous pineapple upside down cake is ready. Let it cool down completely before you slice. If you are liking this recipe then don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and if you are new to my channel then don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more such recipes. This cake is full of flavors, soft and juicy on top. You can even melt and spread some jam to give a shine on the pineapples. If you are trying this recipe then don't forget to share me your experience and the feedback in the comments below. See you all soon with another exciting recipe video. Till then take care and bye bye.